Alright guys, I've got a super quick one for you today. I'm going to show how you can do a jump throw bind in Counter-Strike 2. We posted it before in CSGO and it helped you a lot of you guys out. That was using the workshop map. We obviously don't have workshop maps in Counter-Strike 2, so you're going to have to do it through the console in this case. Now, I've put it up on screen now and I will zoom into it so you guys can actually see it, but I will also have it in the description down below so you guys can copy and paste it. You have to do these three different alias lines. You have to do them one by one. So you have to do it one by one. And then the final one you can then create for that to jump through is this bind. Now I use mouse four for it, but if you didn't want to do mouse four, say for example, for every reason you wanted to use like V for it, just change this to whatever key you want it to be. Obviously, if it's mouse four or something, you actually have to like type it in. And that's all it is. So I'm gonna show you guys putting it into the console now and how it'll work. So let me get into the game and showcase. Now I've spawned in on Anubis, which mouse four is this button here beside my thumb on the Endgame Gear XM2 WE. And if I'm clicking this, obviously you can see I'm not jumping. So now if we go type this into console, I'll then be able to do a jump through. So your first line is this alias plus boing and plus jump. Second line is adding the ding element and then dong. So it's boing, ding, dong. It's basically the way they've named it here, the different aliases. And then finally, like I say, mouse four is what I want. So this is what I'm going to send into it. I've realized my webcam's just covered it. So here you go. I'll actually zoom in on this bit for you now so you can see. Now, that means if I wanted to hit F4, I'm going to jump. But if I was to pull my smoke out, right, and then jump as well. Smoke I misclicked horribly. Trying to showcase it is a little bit difficult. So I'm going to throw it and I'm also going to press this button. And I need to not be able to but you go. You can see I threw a jump throw. Also means then, like say you want to throw a bit, you can do jump throws like that as well. So that's how you create the bind. Super quick, super easy. The one thing you need to keep in mind is you will have to do this every time you load Counter-Strike 2. There is an alternative method you can use which involves messing around with the files, but I've never preferred that. And that's why the last time we worked with the workshop map for it, because I thought that was the best way to do it. Because it's a beta, I don't want to go messing around with the files. I think just open up, save that to a notepad. It's in the description down below. Save it to a notepad, a sticky note, something like that on your desktop. And then literally just copy and paste it in every time you get onto the game. And you'll be sweet. I tried to keep it short and sweet. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button here and here. Thank you for watching. We'll catch you in the next one. Good. Bye.